if a plus b is to a minus b is equal to 1 is to 5, then a square minus b square is to a square plus b square equals what? Now you're given that a plus b, okay, maybe let me use a different color over here, a plus b upon a minus b is equal to 1 upon 5, right? And you're asked to find out what is the value of a square minus b square upon a square plus b square. Now the first obvious thing which might come to your mind is why not to multiply this a plus b with a minus b, right? Because we know a plus b into a minus b is equal to what? It's equal to a square minus b square. But the moment you do that in the denominator, you will end up having a minus b whole square, which is a square plus b square minus 2ab, right? But we don't know what is the value of 2ab and hence this will not work. So we cannot multiply this entire thing by a minus b. But then what do we do? I mean, we have to solve this, right? In such cases, the normal thing which is followed is we will, fo we will add the reciprocal of this number to itself. So let's say if I do a minus b upon a plus b. Okay, since I have added this, I'll need to add the reciprocal of this of our 1 upon 5 over here. Right? So what did I do here? If this was let's say x upon y, I added y upon x. Okay? And similarly, if I had 1 upon 5 over here, I added 5 upon 1. Because both these numbers are equal. Right? Now, what the, oh, you must be wondering, why did I do this in the first place? Look, my idea is to get a square minus b square. Right? If I do this, what I will have is a minus b, a plus b in the denominator, right? And this we know very well is equal to what? a square minus b square. And what we will get is now, if you multiply a minus b, a plus b with this, you will get obviously a plus b. a plus b into a plus b will give you a plus b whole square plus a minus b whole square. Why? Because when I divide a minus b a plus b with this what I am left with is a minus b is equal to 5 is the denominator 5 1 plus 25 or 26 upon 5 right and what do I get here a square plus b whole square will be giving me a plus b square plus 2ab plus a square plus b square minus 2ab right now smartly what I have done is this plus 2ab gets cancelled with this, right? And what am I left with? I'm left with 2a square plus 2b square upon a square minus b square is equal to 26 by 5. If I take 2 common here, I'm left with a square plus b square divided by a square minus b square is equal to 26 by 5. Now I can cancel this 2 with this 26 to give me 13. But what did I require? I required a, minus a square minus b square upon is to a square plus b square. Here I have the reverse. So I can just reciprocate them. So I will get a square minus b square if I move this in the numerator. Obviously 5 also moves it to the numerator. a square plus b square here and 13 here. So 5 is to 13 is the ratio and hence number c is the correct answer for this. Right? So just be careful to see how you get rid of the unrequired numbers, which is basically 2ab in this case. I hope you would have understood this. In case there are any issues, you can write it down in the box below. Thank you for being with us today.